Hello guys, welcome back to another video. Today we're playing YouTube Simulator and the creator of this game really just updated and added a bunch of new secrets in this game that we're going to be testing now. I know I've been uploading a lot, like just like five hours ago, I barely just uploaded a video, but we're going to be testing out these secrets because they are some of I actually could have gotten a faster um, rebirth um, you know, record if he added this more or more earlier it probably would have saved me like 20 seconds but that's fine I already watched all the video and I already saw like you know all of the secrets that he added in this game and we're gonna be going over it and in, at the end of this video we're gonna be crafting the hacked item you know the nature tree but just hacked I did got already all the materials that we need to craft it we're gonna be crafting it at the end but the first easter egg is over here in the items if you go over here to the items and you go to the studio form foam and you buy 43 um orange foam and then if you buy it and then if you could press these three foam all actually six and then it'll open this exclusive foam it's probably not exclusive it'll probably stay here, not here forever but we do have 7700 Dollars, so I'm gonna be spending my money on this knife one because it looks pretty sick and it, it might leave any time soon. So we're gonna be buying a, quite a few of these foam. So I'm just gonna spam the button real quick. So there we go. We got 99 night foam. This is the max we could buy. And then I need, need to get another 99. But I'm just gonna buy this as right now. We got 99 night foam, and now we're gonna head to the second secret, well Easter egg. So the second easter egg is a uh, reason why I'm saying I could have gotten a faster run by the rebirth is if you go to the codes and you enter 1, 2, 3, you go straight away to the um, upgrade section and you don't have to run. So look, if I go to my studio, it does take about like 10 seconds around there to walk to the upgrade section. But now you can save those 10 seconds and you know put the code in 1, 2, 3 mid and you know be already fast enough in the upgrade section which is definitely helpful i'm gonna definitely be using now when i'm grinding tokens now if you go back to the upgrades we're gonna go back to the upgrades and if you enter the code 2 it should add um this thing where it makes you you know run faster to the computer which is also going to be saving a bunch of me time i'm not sure if it stays here or do you have to keep adding the code every time but it's part definitely definitely useful um so you could go faster and there's this other code that i'm gonna try to figure out right now where it highlights the best camera and the best computer so if you enter the code 111 it should highlight the best camera you could buy currently i can't buy any camera so i'm actually gonna get some money i'm actually just gonna use the v-bucks so it highlights the best camera you could get so we're gonna enter the code again 111 it should highlight as you can see right there highlight which camera i could buy well spent all my money on it's pretty useful but at the same time it's not for me because it's not really going to be useful when i'm rebirthing since i'm not trying to buy the best camera since i do need evenly uh, my money you know half half to the computer and uh recording if you enter the code 333 it should like the computer of which one the best you could buy so definitely use the code if you want to it's probably better for the beginners i really won't be using those codes so there's this new gambling in the crafting station if you go to the crafting station you could gamble now which is pretty cool but if you go to the crafting station and if you put one v buck as you can see it says times one question mark it means that one in a 200 chance you could get a hundred v bucks so it's definitely risky not once in a hundred chance i meant once in one in a 200 chance you could get a hundred v bucks as you can see if we try it you lose and then you just keep doing that until you might win who knows i'm just gonna spend a couple of v bucks here i'm not gonna spend all of them because i might not even win i'm just spending them i keep losing it is one in a 200 chance so you could definitely win 100 v bucks or you could definitely lose 100 v bucks so I already spent like 22 V bucks or somewhere around there, and I still keep losing. Um, I'm not sure if I'm gonna keep going. I think I'm not. I'm just gonna waste these last 15 V bucks, and then if I don't win nothing, then I don't win nothing. Cause I don't want to go use it, you know, a lot, and then I'm definitely gonna be losing V bucks instead. 
but yeah, I just keep losing. I don't really have luck, I guess, right now. Since I'm about to waste 50 V Bucks once I do waste these nine um, here, I'm gonna use all these, and then if I don't win, then I don't win. And there's also another gambling with the dollars as well. It's the same thing. I, I'm not sure if it's a one in a 200. It's probably even lower. Um, I'm not sure what are the chance of the dollars, but I'm pretty sure it's probably lower because you do you need to use nine dollars instead of just one. So I'm pretty sure it's lower, or else you'll definitely be losing more money there. So I wasted already like 50 V bucks. I'm not gonna waste any more. But over here, we're gonna try now with the dollars. So you need to place nine dollars, and then actually I forgot you actually win. $17 you can win $17 back or lose so we're gonna go back and yeah we lost so it's a 50 chance of winning um the dollars and it's a 50 chance of losing the your money so you could win $17 or you could win nothing which is pretty cool so we're gonna try one more time and see if we could win um, i don't really care about my dollars since it's really not useful um, I can't really buy nothing and yeah, I just keep losing. I lost three times in a row and it's a 50% chance It's pretty higher more higher than, than the V-Bucks. So it's kind of Scary how I'm losing. Hopefully I don't lose now and I lost. So I'm not gonna waste any more Lost five four times in a row, which is quite Sad the next secret is if you go to the crafting station again And if you place one dollar in the middle you could turn tiny which is pretty it's not really that useful it's just a cool easter egg like the other ones with the yeezys or the i don't know there's a bunch of other codes that are like the same but yeah you turn tiny if you add a dollar in the middle of the crafting station pretty cool so there's there's also this code if you put caps gold you get 10 free gold and i, I have a lot of gold so i actually don't know if i did got 10 gold but i'm pretty sure you do get 10 gold but yeah, just use that code if you want 10 free gold when you're first, you know, playing or, you know, first trying to grind for the material. Alright, so the last Easter egg is which now you can create the hacked uh, nature plaque. This is actually one of the best plaques now in the game, which is a 4200 multiplier or boost. And yeah, it's definitely one of the best plaques now. Which we're gonna be crafting we, we could craft three because i did craft my silver plate buttons into gold and then water and then yeah so in order to create this you need to add four rocks in each corner and then after that you need to add one v buck in the middle and with the rest of the spaces you're gonna add four water potions and then this should create the hacked item as you can see i could create three we're gonna create it there we go we created it um i'm not sure if i do have stuff in my shed i actually do so i'm just gonna go over there to my other place we're gonna go to our studio i'm gonna place it down right here since i do ha i have organized it my place a little bit more and you know got a lot of those chests so we're gonna here's the three hacked um trees which now which gives us a 4200 boost we did have an 82,000 boost and now we have a 90 4,000 boost so we gained 12,000 and you know 600 I think yeah so this is pretty insane we got the hacked item pretty cool so now we have to grind for another black which is gonna be even more harder which now that he removed the five the seven tokens but yeah that is all the easter eggs he added in this video the cool thing is about the new hacked item and the foam I actually want to place down the foam I'm gonna go my um my second place i'm actually gonna reset my character because I, I don't like being tiny i can't really i'm not that tall in the game and it's quite annoying that i'm low so we're gonna go back to our studio we're gonna go to customize we're gonna go to here then it looks like it says we could buy an extra room another one i'm not sure why it says that's probably a bug bug but we're gonna go back to our wall items and then we're gonna get and place down these studio foams that looks actually pretty sick i'm gonna actually place down probably a whole wall over here so there we go we placed down all our foam and that looks actually that foam actually looks so cool I'm, I, I think i might actually buy more um later but that's practically all the video hopefully you guys enjoyed this video um i think the notes the notifications won't come out to you guys since i already posted three videos in a day but yeah hopefully you guys enjoyed this video please subscribe if you're new as well we created the new hack item which will actually we're gonna take a picture 
right there and there we go so hopefully you guys enjoyed this video please subscribe if you're new like i already said it but yeah see you guys in the next one